Welcome to Annie Up, Double XL's podcast where the hip hop and sports worlds collide. The Double XL staff, along with key members of the hip hop community, will be getting listeners caught up on all the major sports news from the past week and take a look at the upcoming games ahead. You'll never know who may stop by on this week's episode. This is hip hop on a higher level. Welcome back, welcome back. This is Double XL, Annie Up. This is Manny. This is Roger. We got a special guest with us. We got Brooklyn's finest right here. Yes, sir. Why don't you int- introduce yourself, young sir? Hey, yo, what's up, man? It's your boy, Two Millie. Millie Rock on Annie Black, man. You know how we rocking, man. Let's get it. After a long break, Annie Up is back, and this one is going to be a hometown special. So so tell me about tell me about Brooklyn. Growing up in Brooklyn, how big was sports in, in Brooklyn? Sports in Brooklyn, if you wasn't sturdy, man, you wasn't coming on the court, man. We <laughs> was playing in 308 Park, and we was playing in 324 Park. For those who don't know, those the the two uh, parks for the schools that's across the street from my from my um, housing park. Okay, house. and you from Best Style, right? Yeah, I'm from the Style. So I used to live in the Style, and every time I used to go out on like a Saturday, I used to be real talk ball up. Like how intense did it used to be? Like how how often? What did you see? What were some of the craziest memories you see, you saw out there? Uh, every Saturday it would be wicked. Uh, my man Eddie, my man Eddie for a, a long time friend from from the block. He was the he was like one of the, he was my age, matter of fact. He was young, but he was dunking on everybody, like all the older guys that come in the park thinking they was doing something, try to box me out because I'm a little man. <laughs> I'll pass it to my man, Eddie. He's slamming. <laughs> what borough has the best basketball players, you think? Uh, Best ba- best basketball players? Because I've been up to Harlem, been up to the Rucker. I've seen people in, uh, in the Bronx. Uh, nah, I don't think nobody ain't balling like Brooklyn, man. Mm. Okay. You know, we, when it's game time, we ball on them. No free throws. <laughs> <laughs> you used to play any sports? Yeah, I used to like, I used to love football, actually, when I was in 308. Mm-hmm. When I was uh, the PSIS school. That's like from kindergarten to eighth grade. I was always football, a football head, man. Word. What position were you just, playing at that time? And it was so crazy. I was every position. Wow. Where I was quarterback in <laughs> some days. Some days I'm wide receiver. Some days I'm running back. And I'm the sturdiest at every one. <laughs> nice. Nice. <Whoa. laughs> That's what's up. Um, when you see people in the NFL now doing the Millie Rock, how crazy is that for you? Shout out my man Mo Wilkinson, man. He's sturdy. <laughs> He's sturdy. Thank God. Shout out the Jets Rock. Shout out all the Rocks, man. Football Rock. Now nah, that's that really mean the most to me, feel me? Because that was my really favorite sport growing up. So when I start to see the football players really do it after the touchdowns, I'll be like, "Yo, that's my man for that." <laughs> Who was the first player you saw actually uh, do the Miller? It was rock? actually Mo Wilkinson. Okay. I seen him do it before the football season started. He used to come down to uh, Club Lust mm-hmm. when we when I used to have my shows in there. That's how we we built our friendship. He used to come down there to my shows and. You know what I'm saying? We used to hang out and stuff. And he used to always do the Millie Rock every time he'd come <laughs> on in the club. And he used to always tell me, yo, when the season start, I'm going to be the first one. You catch a, catch a sack and do the Millie Rock. <laughs> and I always held him to it. And as soon as it started, he caught the sack. He did it. Next thing you know, everybody doing it. That's nice. dope, man. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. That's the some you have to teach. Like, I, there be some people who... Well, Millie Rock ain't sturdy. Yeah. You have to teach There's him? a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> we, 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 they call him Silly Rock. <laughs> they call that Silly Rock. <laughs> Can you tell us the origin of Millie Rock? Because I'm always curious about that. Tell me uh, when did it start? When did you get the name? How did how did it actually, how did the, the Millie Rock come to birth? Millie Rock was always, it was always a dance. It came from, from me and my, um, my good time friends growing up. It basically stemmed from, you know, the, the two-step with the snap pile. Mm-hmm. We used to do it back in the days. Mm-hmm. But it's just like you got to rock militant with it, feel me? You got to <laughs> give, the, give the girls what they want to see. <laughs> I mean, I really basically like do it for the girls, but, you know, oh, I rock with all my guys who fuck with me. Yeah. Yeah. When did you first, when I guess, when did you first do it? And, then like, what was the reaction? When I first did it, well, as far as... As far period, as in, in public, like, when did you was just like... Yo, we used to go to Coney Island every Sunday, like five, six deep. We used to go, and then you know they play that the little silly rock music. Right. And I used to do it. Yo, it used to be like sixty people standing around just recording. So I'm like, yo, if these people just want to do that, 
imagine what these 70,000 people in the crowds want to do. Mm -hmm. So let's stick to that. So I just was doing a dance, doing a dance, and never had no name. Never had a name. Until until uh, Spike Lee, 25th anniversary, do mm -hmm. the right thing, mm -hmm. on Quincy and Stuyvesant down in Brooklyn, New York. So, um, yeah, after that, like, I was... I, I think I got on top of the car, son. <laughs> yeah, I was drinking that Bombay and OJ, so I got on top of the car, <laughs> and I was doing a Millie Rock. And um, it still didn't have no name to it, but I was doing it to my brother's song, Half a Billy. He got the song Trouble out on YouTube. Mm -hmm. I was doing it to his song. So everybody standing around recording. The next day, they're like, yo, you famous on Facebook. And I'm like, huh? So they start sending me the vids and my DM on Instagram. Like, look, 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 you famous. Everybody throwing you up. So I'm like, world, this might be global right here. So I'm like, all right, let me think, let me think. I go in the house, let me find a beat on YouTube or something. I found the beat. Shout out Judo Beats, man. He produced that that fire for me. So I'm like, oh, all right, I can rock with this. Let me think of something repetitive. Let me let me keep the curses to a minimum, and maybe it'll blow. And then right. it just went crazy. And it's out of here, right? Yeah. It's out of here. Right. Uh, first kind of like celebrity then that you saw. I, I remember seeing Travis Scott early yeah. on. Like he took it to the basketball game, actually to Yeezy's basketball yeah, game, right? That's a fact. He had him rocking over. Millie fact. rocking over yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Travel. Shout out Travis Scott. He rocked with us from the beginning. Like he brought us out on the summer on his summer jam set. You know what I'm saying that really sparked everything for as far as Millie Rock. So nice, nice, nice. That's dope, man. What about uh, sports movies, man? What do you? What's What's your favorite sports movie? Sports movie. I don't, I don't know. You don't even not right now because I don't really be like in the house. I be on the run. I mean, right, I don't right. Get to watch TV as much. Okay. Here's the question: If you could be any athlete, like you could be like, I mean, you can pick any sport to play. Yeah. What would you play? Uh, right now, I don't think I'll play football, man. They might hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> so I think I had to rock with basketball. I was looking at this, uh, listening to the radio, and I always think, I think I want to put, make my son to be a baseball player because the money they get is yeah, that was, it's crazy. That's the easiest thing. Yeah. <laughs> man, I strike out every shot and still take the M's. <laughs> so that first base, chilling. Yo, <laughs> they make so much money guaranteed. They get them M's. And I'd be like, yo, Free for M's. for like a, a reserve pitcher, you can get like a couple of hundred, couple of, uh, couple of mils. Super. I think I may do that. Man. The easiest sport. But to I do. just rock with basketball because I really like, I like to use my energy. Feel me? So. Right. And you mentioned Kyrie Irving. So how did yeah, that? Shout out Kyrie Irving, man. He uh, he actually glowed the um, Melly Rock up. He really? Posted, he posted on Instagram. He was doing it to Justin Bieber song, and then he wrote like, uh, <laughs> when you when you only Melly Rock, when you when you uh only do the Melly Rock dance, but. You only listen to Justin Bieber, so he doing the Millie Rock with Justin Bieber. That was crazy. Did he reach out to you ever? Yeah, or? he said nothing but love. Hey, he he followed me on Instagram. Dope. Like, yeah. Dope, nice, dope. Man. Shout out Kyrie, man. You about to, so you're going to check the Cavaliers when they're in town? Yeah, super, man. Anytime. All right. How has things changed since the song? Like, what, what, what tell me, like, how is, like, I'm always curious about, like, what changes after something goes viral like that. <laughs> He's got a lot to say. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, it, well you can say things change, but not really much. Like as far as me and my guys, we still on the same page. We still all do the same thing. But as far as everybody else, like it's crazy now. Like, yeah, I'm about to say you walking down the street, people be just like, yo. I don't really get too much of that unless I'm really like downtown Brooklyn. Yeah. Like we still do the, we still do the. When we walking past, people look, people look. I feel like you know. Then we be like, what's up? You know how the Millie rock? Damn, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> but sometimes they don't really like recognize on like eyesight catch, but you know, I don't mind. What's but the city? Really much changed though. What's the city? I saw I saw you performed in LA. I saw some some clips of you performing in LA. But what's the city that actually embraced the the Millie Rock that you didn't expect that they took over and is is just banging out there? Where? Yeah. NC. Yeah. Wow. North Carolina, Greensboro. They they booked us out there like. Six times in a month. Already? Yeah. Sheesh. Yeah. Six how's it performing out there? Nah, we love it out there. I'm about to say, how's Shout the out. vibe? Yeah. Nah, they, roll, they rock with us heavy, too, though. Yeah. I think, I'll be thinking, like, yo, when we go to these spots, they won't really, like, show as much love, or they might not know the words, but they really be wilding. That's so dope, man. Yeah. 
It's a dope experience. What else you got going on? What you else you got going on? I got on? Welcome to Millieville dropping, man. Probably like the second weekend in January. So, you know, you can look out for that. I ha- I actually have the documentary with it, so that should be... I'm not sure where I'm going to place it at, but that should be out, so y'all can expect that, too. Documentary? Yeah. It's like basically like the come up and the, the struggle of everything. I really oh, rock. so you've been recording every every yeah. step you've been doing. That's yeah. dope, man. Yeah. Definitely. Like Nobody's been doing that. Shows and stuff. Shows and showing how we shoot videos on our block and everything. I'm going to just put that out, so you can look for that. That's really good. Nice, nice, nice. Um... Well, I think we're good. I think this was pretty good. I want to see. I can't wait to see how big Millie Rock is because now with the playoffs coming, that's probably going to be the go-to celebration. Yeah, shout out to the guys on the remix, man. You know how we rocking, man. Oh, man, is the remix coming up? Shout out to the guys on the remix, man. It's crazy. I think Millie's going to give us the scoop real quick right now. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, uh, Wilkerson who's, who's, on the remix. Shout, yeah. out, shout out to the homie Fab, man. Y'all know it's always Brooklyn. Nice, nice, always nice, Brooklyn, nice, nice. You know how we rock. And yeah. let me ask you, being in NC and the Carolina Panthers, Cam Newton yeah. dabbing everywhere. Yeah. I think we might see him doing the Millie Rock since you I out think there. So. so yeah, we might have to get up on him. <laughs> yeah, you gotta hit him up with you know perform that shit at the Super Bowl because. Oh yeah, we was just in Pittsburgh with um with the homie Martavis Bryant. Oh, oh get out of here, yeah. dog. Yeah, we oh, was that, out there with him. That dude's a monster, man. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's fine. Yeah. That's what, have you guys uh, obviously going to the clubs and all that and just performing, have you guys seen like sports athletes just bug the fuck out? I mean, uh, obviously you mentioned the dude from the, Yeah, all the time. Yeah, like, yeah, they be with us when when they come in and we in the same spots, they come with us and we all rock. Shout out my man Lance Stevenson yeah, too. Man. Oh, Lance! Yeah. <laughs> that's right, he did it in the car. Born right? ready. He, he, yes. Anyway, he see us is always love, man. He always born ready. ready. Yeah. What do you think about his rapping skills? His rapping skills, I haven't heard. Of. Oh, you haven't heard Lance? Lance, Lance be going in. Lance be going in. I need to do a song together. Yeah. That'd be kind of crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Well, man, yo, thank you for coming out. I really appreciate this, man. Appreciate for it, real. This has been great. Um, guys, thank you all for listening. Welcome back. The season's going to be really, really great. 2016, look out for more stuff. All hip-hop news. You can take it. You can take a look at XXLMag.com. This is Manny. This is Roger. It's your boy, 2 Millie, man. XXL. Let's get it. All right, let's get it. We Peace. out.